I saw we are drive, I saw we are watch the meter. I saw we are drive, I saw we are watch the meter. Boom, 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 boom. Every day and every night, every night. Hey guys, welcome to another video. I hope that you guys are doing well. If you're new here, my name is Rush Cam and this is my YouTube channel. I'm a Jamaican attorney turned content creator. And on this channel, you can find us talking about life, sharing our life, lifestyle, like education, entertainment, everything in between. So if that is something that you're interested in, click the subscribe button, join the Rush Fam, and come on on our journey. Also, if you are not new here, you are a returning resident, you've been here before, the place looks familiar, then hit that like button click the notification bell so you know when our video drops and leave a comment i really appreciate it and every chance i get i engage with the comments because i love to hear what you guys think if you didn't get a chance to check out my last video i'm gonna put it in the description box and in the pinned comment i spoke about therapy in jamaica and discussed all things connected to it the cost the resources and all that you need to know so if that's something that you're interested in definitely check it out and of course follow me on all socials at rushcam i would definitely love to see you guys over on twitter over on tiktok over on instagram so that we can interact with each other throughout the week so if you notice this week i'm wearing um a durag head tie kill him with it now yeah um so i am wearing a durag that is jamaican made it is made by anna ixc i'll put her down below it's ra the ra brand and so i definitely thought that i should wear it today feel like it matched my skin tone and it's black history month so yeah anyway so let's get into today's video so i love doing story times i like telling the story them because my life is so eventful us and when your life is eventful us it is because you are supposed to share it with generations to come so this story is about how I got stuck in Miami but this is like literally part one of several different times that I've been stuck in Miami look like some Miami I mean agreement if we go back to Miami worse like how COVID up there worse like how them deep in the middle of a pancreas a Panasonic a panorama a Panera bread yeah I'm not going back but if you're ready for the story, say story time. Comment down below and say story time. Story time, story time. All right, so for those of you who don't know, I went to school in Barbados for university, right? Um, so I did my law degree in Barbados and I came back to Jamaica to go to Norman Manny Law School. Cool? So when I was in faculty of law at Barbados, I was super, super, super involved and I was pretty smart so i was i did mooting which is more like legal and then i also did debating which everybody know about debating debate um where you say be it resolved be it resolved that youtubers should do this be it resolved that you are a role mother for kids be it resolved be it resolved be it resolved so you have the mooting and then you have the debating so let me just do a little brag for Mootin. I was a part of the first English speaking team to win the Inter-American Sustainable Development Trilingual Competition. So we basically went up against teams in Spanish, Portuguese and English and we were the top team overall. We won the Mootin competition and we were the first English team to win the competition. Bright. Hello. Anyway, that is not what this story is about. This story is about debating. So people, people 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 i tried out for a debate competition right and i did not get through i was the first person who did not get through so i was you know say them have like them have lists and in case you do in case 
I was the first bench. Me get bench. Not the first time I ever get bench. Won't be the last, but me get bench. But you know, say, I'm a trying guy. So me up on the bench and me just ready. So it was six people on the team. Teams of two, three teams that the university was sending to this competition, the debate competition in Miami at University of Miami. So now, me never met the team. So I said, all right. Plan my life, go through and everything. Can you know say, boy is triumphant, boy must make it in a life. If I ever make it in life, make it in life. Yeah. So now, people, one of the boys them were tried for the competition, never have a visa. And him go apply to embassy for the visa. And he was a final year student and the embassy told him no because them did free him would have run off and don't come back. So me in my bed in the beautiful flats of Barbados and we I hear bring 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 rush in, pack your bags, we're going to Miami. I was just like dam bada pa pa da pa da 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 Walmart Target Starbucks JC Penny everything everything Farin Dollar Tree, yeah, that's me. So I'm ready now, you know. So me pack my bag them, cause me's a guy, me's a guy. When it's time for go foreign, I am ready, because ready. And them time they know me never know enough, but me did ready. Anyway, so now I'm on the team. I'm going to Miami, back up, make it ready. So guys, we went to Miami. <laughs> We went to this competition in Miami and the truth of it is that we were super, super, super talented, but we were out of our league. Not out of our league because we never have sense. Not out of our league because we never know. Not out of our league because we did dunce. But out of our league because their debating styles were just not like ours. So this is University of Miami and their universities from all over the US and their, their style was more, you know, we studied parliamentarian, I think, and their thing, we studied British parliamentarian and them studied something else. So, you know, so we'll go there and we ask them, we don't know what to say, we don't know what to say. So, my team will never make it past the first round. Me and the girl, Rashana, big up this, Rashana, if you're watching this, <laughs> we never make it. And we were just like, okay, well, we didn't make it. Cool, that ain't no problem. One thing with me and anybody who goes to school and enter competition for school knows they get per diem spending money. You know, you look at food money or whatever. Me, save up my food money. My food money save up because I have to go up to Dolphin Mall. I have to go to sell grass. So, me ready now, you know, me pack my things and I said, guys, I am going to the mall. Cause my hotel competition, I never, hello, thank you for the trip. I never make it. I'm going to buy some things. So I'm going to go sell grass now, I'm going to buy my things, I'm going to buy my little bath and body works, you know, you have to buy little things and for care about your friend, you can't go this, you that, you know, there is, I can go, everything. Cool? Guys, that is not the point. The next team, never make it. The next team, never make it. All of this happened within two days. We're in Miami for like three to four days. Well, we did that for the last night now. <laughs> and the coach... The coach, him gone to dinner, gone to bed, or gone somewhere. God, me no know. Because we don't make it, him not responsible for we lay down and uh, wait on the flight for go back to Barbados, losers. Anyway, so I sit down there now, you know, and I said to Anika, Anika, if you're watching this, Anika from Dominica, yeah. I said to Anika, Anika, come and go out now. Anika said, Roshin, I don't know about that, you know. I don't know about that. Um, because I don't know if we have enough money to go to go to the club. I don't know about that. So I said, Anika, you ought to get some money, eh? So me and Anika have our money, you know, but enough away, a six away. So one girl, she said, my mood partner, my mood partner, my debate partner, said she no one going to win. All right, Roshana, stay here. But everybody else said they want to go. Guys, these are 2014 days, or 2015. So we said, all right, now. We're gonna go to the club, we're gonna go to the club. So <laughs> wait there. Wait. Well I'll follow the story. So long story short, for those who slow and can't catch, long story short, I made it on a debate team for my school. 
the competition was in Miami. We're in Miami now. We never make it to the finals. So this is the night before we're supposed to leave. So we decided to wear go out. Got it? Good. <laughs> there is a kangaroo. What we say we get? Everybody get them per DM, right? So it's five of us now. We say we're going to the club. Anika does the research. Tick, 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 tick. We are go to the club. We are go to the club. She said, "All right, Rush. We can go to this club. This club is this kilometers away, and let's take a cab. Them time there, Uber on a bus road, a cab. And what you know about cab in America? Meter, <laughs> meter, 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 guys." So we planned it out and we and we asked the receptionist to call and we kind of basically figured that it would have cost us like $45 to go each trip. So it would be $45 to go, $45 to come. It's five of us. So basically each person would pay, since it's $90, each person would pay $10. Plus we have to go in the club, we have to drink, we have to do that. Guys, we're in the taxi. And the man I drive slow. When we say the man I drive slow, I mean turkle. I mean ninja turk. I mean. I saw the man I drive. When we say, I saw the man I drive. People, 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 people. I saw we are drive, I saw we are watch the meter. I saw we are drive, I saw we are watch the meter. I saw we are drive, I saw we are watch the meter. And the man take the long route. So, so Anika said, um, Sir, my thing said, I, I didn't know that this was the route you were going to take. He's like, That's the route. Long story short, when we reach, we forgot $100. $100. $100, guys. We don't reach where we are going yet. I mean, we're not going on a club yet. We're not going to party yet. We're not going to win hundred dollars spend. Mark your me spend off my per diem, and you can spend off everybody hundred dollar. All right, that is one way. What were we planning to spend each way? We were planning to spend forty five dollars each way. That is ninety dollars overall, and we spent a hundred dollars one way, and we are still dense. None of us have any um credit card are not like so anyway we reach at the club now how much for going to the club 25 dollar per person jesus have mercy me, me never got me yard i want to make love in this club day but me don't have any money me not have no money but don't have no money so we say, all right, then fine. We are going to take our money now and we are going to the club. Anika, I have to make up somebody. Me, I have to make up somebody. Somebody else have to make me up. Somebody only work with $40. Him, him, $40 done, whatever, whatever. So we end up going to the club. It's like I said, that night we weren't supposed to go anywhere. Tell me why. Subscribers, comment down below. Tell me why when we, as we step into the club. Shake that thing, miss. Can I, can I shake that thing, miss? Annabella, boom, 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 boom. <laughs> when I said I don't know what happened, I don't know if a gun shot, I don't know if a way I drop a bomb over there, bad man, go ahead. No, we don't know. I don't know what happened. All I know is that the club went flat. People are jump over so far. Every I'm just like, I, 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 I know so I should I leave my yard in a minute. I know I'm a loving Christian boy. Why I come out and come man, I come a club. I not even go asylum in Jamaica. I not even go fiction. I not even go um top floor. What me I do a club in Miami? Hey, gunshot all the way. Scatter, 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 scatter. I not even know it's a gunshot all now. I just know it's a fight broke out and back broke and everything. And Anika is like, Guys, I told you, I told you. I <laughs> mean, I said, Lord Jesus, I didn't come in the house. I was just like, I was in the house. Alright. <laughs> so, we end up buy a one drink. Drink a little ginger ale and a little rum. Because you know, it's like Caribbean people, so we have to drink what we know. And whatever. We never have a good time. Me a hold on to my pocket the whole time because them time them have no driver's license. You know what in my pocket? My passport. 
and I hold on for dear life. I say, Father Long will know all about it. Father Long will understand why. Cheer up, my brother. Let's go back to the hotel. Anyway, so we we'll reach outside now. Can we get a taxi to go home? Back to the hotel. Could we get a ta the taxi man say I come back for you now? Cause remember we don't have no internet, no Wi-Fi, no nothing. Could we get a ride back home? No. Could we get a ride back home? No. So <laughs> we spend nine hundred dollar go. <laughs> we spend twenty five dollar going to the club. Gunshot nearly liquid. We buy the drinks. We now no more money. Oh, we are go home, people. Oh, we are go back at the hotel. Oh, we are go back at the hotel. By the way, Aninka was the only girl. One girl, four boy. Oh, we. Oh, we are go back at the hotel. Black people, no foreign accent. I mean, as in no American accent. I be. Hello. We stand up on the road like hookers and prostitutes into the night in Miami looking for a cab. Nobody would take us anywhere. We stand up there for about half an hour. We just a walk with nervous. Me I say, a DC come down to? Me start get serious now guys in other store because me still nervous to this day. Anyway, lift up your spirits guys. The story nearly done. Anyway, Anika she now go and put on American accent. Hey man, um... Hey, we're going to the, um, I'm visiting my cousin from Atlanta, um, I'm from Atlanta, and, you know, I'm just, I'm just visiting my cousin, but all of us here were cousins, and we're, we're trying to get to the hotel to look for my cousin, and we lost our, we lost our phone, and we don't know how we're gonna get to the, the thing, whatever. Whatever, like, she, she started putting on the accent, you know, so me, I said, oh, that God, I need to away, you get this accent here from me, sis? Anyway. She said, Yo, we, we, we're trying to get to the cab. Da, da, da. So the one taxi man end up take way. That is a long story short. One taxi man end up take way. People, people, I saw we are drive, I saw we are watch the meter. So we are drive, I saw we are watch the meter. We add up fuel with bus fee already and realized that we only have $40 or about 45 You see, when the man reach halfway, the meter buck 65 so we done $25 shot you hear what i'm saying we not have it we don't have it anyway i need to chat out the man up at the front boat oh yeah we we're not from around here you know but like my dad romy and drop asleep boop so and so colin drop asleep boop kale drop asleep boop me in a i saw me a me a try not sleep in a camera said human trafficking this is not it me a try no sleep. So, me end up doze off in a one sleep. I'm a wake up. Uh, Anika asked me. First of all, Anika said, don't talk. None of us not talk. Because none of us have an American accent. So, that's going to kill the story. Me a drop asleep. Both. I'm a wake up. Anika said, um, yeah, so when you hear me, where we there? <laughs> me roll at the back of the taxi. Where we there? The man is like, what's he saying, man? She's like, I don't know like sometimes he breaks out into like different caribbean accents when when he's like sleeping or whatever anyway we end up drop asleep so if the man was going to take away he would have take away because me around the back dead sleep anyway me just know say the man drop it off at the, the the hotel me also know say we did only have 45 dollars me know say the bill come up to 75 or must be 80. Taxi man, if you're watching this, God bless you. I don't know how it pay. I don't know how the rest of the money pay. I don't know if we were touched by an angel when you walk. I don't know. Can't even walk without you, old man. I don't know. All I know is that we were stuck in the middle of the club. And we never have no way to get to my Anika chat out the man and me drop asleep. And when me wake up, me reach when me must go. How it pay for I don't know. Up to this day, I must call her. I don't know. Do I have a clue? But I saw it go when you're enough. Because nothingness is a gift. And you have a bond with it. No, enough, enough, you know. What are we doing? We could have go out for dinner. We could have go yes, so we could have go there. So we could have all play a little card game in that night. That was actually when I think that was when Casey was that when Casey entered Miss Universe? 
I think so. Yeah, I think it was that night. But yeah, I don't know how, how we reach where we are going. I don't know if Anika boops out the man or what. I don't know. I think she wrap up the money and just give him a walk off and run in the hotel. I think so. I think so. I mean, I don't know if the guy did like her off. I don't know. But that is the story. <laughs> guys, comment down below and tell me if this has ever happened to you guys. Where you're in a foreign country. Or you're in a foreign place. Or you're, and you're just, your money short. And you're just enough. But you still have to have a good time. Don't make it happen to you. Me now, in my big 27 year old stage. That could have happened to me. Could have happened to me. Enough, enough. Well, how old was I at that time? 21? No, that could not happen to me now. Could not happen to me now. Mad? Mad? Mm -mm. I would not allow it to. So, comment down below and tell me if that has ever happened to you. And if you're in my situation, what would you do? What would you do? I don't know. It was just a really fun story time. And I love sharing stories with you guys. <laughs> but, I don't know. Taxi man, thanks. And who did I shoot up the club? Thanks, because the bullet never licked me. Father God, thank you. Boom, dodge that bullet. But, yeah, that is why I'm afraid of club offering. I'm afraid. Afraid bad. Um, yeah. <laughs> so, if you enjoyed this video, guys, click the like button, leave a comment, and share it with your friends. Of course, we're going to do our subscriber shout-out because I love when you guys ring me up and say something good and rate it so this week's subscriber shout out is actually someone who made a tweet with um a, a snippet from this video as well as several comments under the video and it went really well on twitter he's also a youtuber his name is raheen frith 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 but his YouTube name is Raheen TV. So shout out to Raheen. Thank you so much for the support. And thank you for that very, very, very funny comment. Um, I mean, tweet. It was really funny. And also, shout out to Joby J. Joby J said, Leave it up to Rushcam to talk about the things that matter. Bless you. Bless you, Joby J. Um, Joby J is just super, super, super amazing. Oh, I want to shout out one more person. Shanika Williamson. She said, okay, let us talk about the camera quality. Let's talk about Rush Cam Mara. And we are also in a Rush Cam era. Wow. Ooh, lyrics. Ooh. Lyrics. Um, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Remember, we post videos every Wednesday and every Sunday. So I hope, hope, hope that you guys stick around and just... Come on with me for the journey. Uh, have a great weekend. Have a great week. Check up on all the videos that you missed out. And let's say pack up after three. One, two, three. Pack up. <laughs>